Good morning and welcome back to Darwin. We're just in the Vic Arcade, part of the Vic Hotel originally. We'll just have a look through here and we'll walk through to the West Lane Arcade where I've discovered a fairly excellent little fruit and juice stall. So yeah, we're just underneath the West Lane car park here. So yeah, it looked like they got some uh, nice fruit salad options yeah, there. Come back and get a juice. So we'll come back to that place. So we're just going past the Continental Barbers now. You can go and see Charlie and uh, get a haircut in there. So we're just heading out towards West Lane itself and we'll cut across to Mitchell Street. If you've ever got a spare few minutes, uh, take a walk up West Lane and Austin Lane. You'll see some fairly excellent uh, paintings on office walls, hotels, just spare bits of space where they've got these paintings, they're fantastic. So we'll just duck through here, uh, we're just beside the Hilton Darwin. So anyway, we're just going to have a walk around the city. It's about 10 in the morning. So all the thousands of people that drive into the city are at work. That's why the streets look reasonably quiet. But we're slowly getting into the dry season. Getting a little bit of rain and a bit of stickiness in the evenings. Highly recommend the Pepperberry restaurant there in the Hilton. Alright, so we're just looking at Mitchell Street here. Got the Northern Land Council just across the road there. This is a fairly popular bus drop-off, so you can walk straight through there back to the mall. Or you can go to the Darwin Hotel, just on our right there. Just got the brown sugar cafe just on the left there. Just heading around the corner here to the deck bar. A fairly popular meeting place uh, for the after work crowd. And I understand they do a very good laxa as well.
right, so we've just got the Rendezvous uh, Cafe here on the left. Always popular with the office workers. We're just on Bennett Street now and the new building right in front of us on the left is the Charles Darwin Centre which is one of the Paspali buildings. Very new and modern uh, type of building and just on the left is uh, the new uh, place of the uh, bush traders so you can buy their produce uh, and you can get a coffee in there as well all right so just across the road there is the tourist information bureau so if you want to book any tours or just get information in general that's the place to go. Just on the right on the corner there, if you want to jump onto the double decker, the red double decker bus. Uh, that does the uh, tour around Darwin to all the historical sites. That's where you pay for your ticket and join it. All right, we'll just take a walk down Smith Street Mall here. Fairly quiet this time of day. Got some nice specialty shops. Got the odd public servant ducking out for a coffee. was a quite a busy place uh, last weekend with it being Easter of course and the preceding week was the school holidays for the Northern Territory so we did have a lot of visitors to town so it was a little bit uh, more bustling than what you see today This little section in front of us is called the Galleria. A few specialty stores inside and some uh, nice little uh, uh, cafes if you uh, and takeaway places if you want to get a snack. Still quite a bit of construction going on here in the mall. Been going on for about three months updating some of the old arcades and buildings.
So this is pretty much the end of the mall and uh, Smith Street does continue uh, right down to the Cullen Bay roundabout. So yeah, plenty of your scooters there to help you get around. Neuron uh, have these scooters as well as the electronic push bikes. We'll just continue our walk uh, down Nucky Street. Just on the right there you've got Salvatore's Cafe and uh, McDonald's. Just on the left here, this building, it's uh, John Johns, he's a very nice fellow and uh, you can get some excellent ice creams and gelatos in there. Pretty quiet street this morning, so we'll just duck across here. Just point out the Non La restaurant just to the left here of the Golden Phoenix, Vietnamese and Thai dishes there. So we're back on Mitchell Street, right in front of us is the Mitchell Centre. You've got shops on the outside here and on the inside. A nice little arcade. And they do have free parking underneath. I think it's uh, free parking for about two hours. Just on the wall here of monsoons. Got your magpie geese there. Fantastic mural. So monsoons, one of a few late night uh, establishments. If you want to kick on a little bit, that's the place to go. And Wisdom's Bar and Cafe just on the right.
Okay, here's a fairly large uh, backpacker Hostel Malaluka on Mitchell, or more commonly known as uh, MOM or MOMS uh, these days. And that will uh, be full to capacity fairly soon as we start getting a few more music festivals in town. Okay, we're just coming up to the tap bar. Now, a lot of people might know that this is a pretty busy place in the evening. They have live music and uh, they'll attract quite a crowd. But it's interesting, they do serve a pretty good breakfast in there as well. That's why you will see um, it well patronised throughout the day. So this is Crocosaurus Cove. So if you're limited for time and you can't get out to one of the rivers and see some jumping crocodiles, this is a good place to see them uh, in the tanks. They've uh, got some four, four and a half meter crocs in there as well as a lot of the smaller ones that you can get up quite close to. So I would recommend having a look in there if you're just looking to uh, burn up a little bit of time. And uh, this is the booking office here and just around the corner for Mr Matt Wright. If you want to go on some of his safaris, that's the place to uh, get your ticket. Right across the road from the Shenanigans Irish Bar. This is the Youth Shack um, backpackers, a little bit smaller than the MOM, but um, reasonably popular. Alright, we've got the Six Tanks Brewery uh, just here. You can get a nice meal in there, lunch or in the evening. Can sit outside or enjoy the air conditioning on the inside. Nice little cafe down that arcade, Ruby G's.
right, so we're just back at the Mitchell Centre. Uh, nice big coals in there for all your food items. Coffee club, do a very nice breakfast. Alright, we're just back at the intersection of Mitchell and Nucky. So it's a nice sunny morning. We're getting close to the dry season. And as a local, I find it quite comfortable walking around. I think we're hovering around 30 degrees right now. various symbols of uh, what you can expect to see in the Northern Territory there, the, the Brolga, the Barramundi, the Mud Crab, the Gecko, even the Laxa has made it onto this artwork. Crocodiles, So uh, just a, a stroll around the Darwin City Centre uh, this morning. So thanks very much for watching and uh, we will see you in the next video. Bye for now. Get a juice, please. Uh, ginger, lime, honey, thanks. Ginger, lime, honey. Yep. Thank you. What size are uh, Just a medium will be fine, thanks.